Hey, hey, angels. What's up? It's your girl, Alicia, and I'm here today with another video. Welcome to the Angels Academy, a God-ordained safe space for men and women to heal, to be vulnerable, and to grow into the fullness of God. And so if this is your first time to the channel, welcome to the Angels Academy. I'm so excited to be here with you guys today, and I got a message for you guys from the Lord. And so before we dive into this video today, I just wanted to take a second and thank all of my angels that wish me a happy birthday. I love you guys so much. I had an amazing weekend. And thank you to everybody that showed love. Thank you to everybody that sent gifts, right? That sold it to the ministry, that sent birthday money. Thank you to everybody that's sending gifts to the P.O. Box. I got all of you guys' messages and comments. Thank you guys for all of the love and support. You guys are amazing. All the real ones, all the ones that really love me and support me. And so I really appreciate you guys. A lot of people got blocked this weekend. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, a lot of people got blocked this weekend. And y'all know how I get when I get on that block button, I go for it. And so it is what it is. They're going to have to watch somebody else on YouTube. And so anyway, let me just take a second and thank all of my moderating brothers and sisters. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for holding down the chat. Listen, I got some moderators that do not play about me, period. And if you come crazy down below in the chat and you guys say it with me, block, glory be to God. It's really a blocking season. I can feel it. I can smell it. Mm -hmm, it is. <laughs> and so let me just take a second and thank my Super Chat family. I love and appreciate you guys so much. Thank you guys for so into God's vision here on the channel. You guys are greatly appreciated. And so do you guys got your Bibles? You got to know I got mine. Comment down below. I got my Bible, sis. I got my Bible so you know it's real. Glory be to God. And you guys already know what I always say. If you got your Bible app on the phone, that's fine. We still going to get into this word today. And so before we dive into this word, you guys know that we got to take a second and allow the Holy Spirit in. Although I know he's already already here because he's within me but you guys know that we do nothing here without God and so father God in the name of Jesus I thank you Lord I thank you for your mercy your grace and your protection father I thank you for all the angels all over the world everybody that you're lead into the channel Lord Jesus I thank you for helping us to keep you as the source of our life father I ask that you lead and guide this conversation today Lord whatever it is you want to speak to your people I ask that you use me today father in the name of Jesus I pray amen comment down below amen so I know it's real glory be to God Okay, Angel. So let's get into this word. I'm so excited to be back with you guys. I miss you guys so much. And so God told me to title this message today, Supernatural Grace, Favor, and Abundance. Glory be to God. And so we're going to start this word off in scripture. God led me to Isaiah chapter 55 verse 5. And we're going to read it together as a family. So come on, y'all. Let's read it. Okay, family, let's get it. Chapter 55, we're going to go down to verse 5. This is where it starts. And it says, you also will command nations you do not know. And peoples unknown to you will come running to obey. Because I, the Lord your God, the Holy One of Israel, have made you glorious. So glory be to God and God bless this word today. And so a little bit of context on the scripture, right? This is Isaiah in the scripture and he is actually giving the people of Israel some type of hope. And he's trying to let the people know that there's about to be a turnaround. Glory be to God. And they were coming out of captivity. Glory be to God. But God has something new for them. Listen to what I'm saying to you guys today. And so if this is your word today, you are right in alignment, saith the Lord, with your assignment. And you are about to experience the wonder of God's hands. Listen, this is a season of glory and favor. God sent me here to tell you guys today that things are about to turn around in your favor. Mark my words. God is saying that nations are coming to you. Glory be to God. And that you are coming out of a season of lack. And God is saying that you will summon nations. This is literally what the scripture is saying. Catch this message in your spirit. This is your season to take dominion over your territory, saith the Lord. And God is about to supernaturally open new doors to you. And this is a season of abundance. Make no mistake about it. Your life is about to multiply and increase. Comment down below, sis. This is my word today. If this is your word. I heard the spirit of the Lord say uncommon favor. Listen, the table is prepared. God is saying today, honor and promotion is your portion. Glory be to God. Come into agreement with God's glory. If this is your word today, because God is saying that this is going to be a month of splendor. Glory be to God. And so I looked up the different meanings for splendor and 
it says luxury, richness, glory, beauty, listen, elegance, nobility, majesty, grand. Listen, this is the season where everything is about to be big. Listen, go big or go home. See, God is about to make a big move. A move from God is coming and it's going to be grand. I just feel led to say that. <laughs> listen, you are going from literally waiting for the blessing to walk in it. Listen, there are some huge changes that are about to happen, family. Make no mistake about it. And see, this is where you start to see things move. Glory be to God. And what God has promised you is coming. Make no mistake about it because I just kept hearing in the spirit, but God, when? Glory be to God. But God, I'm so tired. Listen, God is saying today, what he has promised you is on the way. And God is about to make you glorious. <laughs> this is literally what the scripture is saying. Listen, you are being positioned in a place of glory. It is a grace that is being placed upon your life to dominate, to enter rooms that you do not qualify for. Listen, to be respected and honored. Catch this message in the spirit. To take hold of unmerited blessings. Listen to what I'm saying to you guys today. This is a season of spiritual authority. And where people said you can't, God is about to show up and show them that you can and you will. Woo, who am I talking to today? I feel led to say that God is going to supernaturally provide everything that you need in this season. See, what you got to understand is that God is your source. Glory be to God. Somebody ain't going to understand what I'm saying until I say this. God is the plug. Listen, this is what I'm saying. You ain't got to worry about nobody else validating you. Listen, you ain't got to worry about nobody else providing anything for you. Listen, and even through the opposition, God is saying that you will prevail. Who am I talking to today? And every tongue that rises up against you shall be condemned, saith the Lord. The enemy can't stop this favor. Listen, your family can't stop this favor. Mm, this is a word. Your haters can't stop this favor. Listen, and you will be rewarded for your obedience. Make no mistake about it because God is saying today it's because of your faithfulness. Who am I talking to? I heard the spirit of the Lord say that I am going to supply all of your needs. Somebody comment down below all. Holy Spirit kept giving me five, five, five. Five is the number of grace. Get ready for God to grace you in every area of your life. Family, look me in my eyes when I tell you this. He will not fail you. Listen. And so the scripture is literally saying that God is about to glorify you. Your gifts are about to draw people close to you. God is saying today the nations are coming. Listen, you are a spiritual warrior if this is your word today. And God is saying that it is your time now. Get ready. I just feel led to say that. Get ready. Because God wants you to win. Because you are made in his image. And so understand that if God called you, nothing can stop you. Listen. There's going to be a lot of people mad about that when y'all receive this message in your spirit. I heard God. I say I chose you. Let me see if I can break this thing down to you guys the way the Holy Spirit gave it to me. Because you know God communicates to me a little bit different, family, right? And so the presence of God will bring glory to your life. Listen, the outpouring is coming. It's coming, y'all. Be patient. God is saying, trust me. Listen, God will call your name to the nations. And see, some of you guys been worrying about other people that's been talking about you. Don't worry about what they talking about. Because they ain't saying nothing for real. God sent me here to tell you guys today they talking about you because they supposed to talk about you. Listen. God is giving you power and authority to command a nation. When you speak a word, it shall come to pass. And see, this is what you got to understand. All of that pressure that's been applied to your life, it's been applied to make you a diamond, baby. You got to understand that God is working on something here. Listen, God says that my ways are not your ways. Glory be to God, and my thoughts are not your thoughts. So don't get so tied up on the promise, because the promise is coming. God is saying today, I need you to just keep focusing on the process. Listen, I don't know who it is that I'm talking to today, but God is saying that there is an anointing on your life. You are walking into a season of great favor because God will glorify you. I feel led to say walk in your destiny because God is going to exalt you. Don't even worry about the enemy because what they meant for evil, God is about to turn this thing around for good. Somebody comment down below a turnaround. Now catch this message in your spirit. April, this month, the world will see God's glory all over your life. This is that turning point moment. You are walking into an abundant life and you will carry the presence of God with you wherever you go and he will be with you. Somebody comment down below all the time. And God is literally saying today that these people are about to run. Listen, they are about to come running to obey you. Listen, God is in control and he is leading your life right now. You are about to walk into a season where you're going to go from glory to glory. And you got to understand that you are the light. And this is why darkness is attracted to you. And see, this is why your life might irritate a lot of demons. Don't worry about it. They're not mad at you. They mad with the spirit that's inside of you. Listen, understand that God already has a plan and a promise for your life. And you are out of captivity. Say of the Lord. And God is about to turn things around for you. <laughs>
This is a word. And this is already going to be confirmation for what God has already placed in your spirit. And so if this is your word today, hear me out. You are called by God. You are of royal priesthood. God is saying the promises, they come in. Listen, it has to be released. And understand that you are equipped with everything you need. And so even when you feel like you are not worthy, God sent me here to tell you guys today, you are worthy of this. And this is the thing. Your life is about to lead other people to God. The value that's within you is grand. Understand that you are already touching on territories that belong to your blessings. Your name is already being endorsed behind closed doors. And you are finally entering into a season where their doubt didn't believe that you can have. Glory be to God, but God is saying it's yours for the taking. Take it. Glory be to God. Take it by force. I don't know who I'm talking to today, but this is your God did it year. Somebody comment down below. God did it. Y'all, he did it. Glory be to God. God is saying walk into it. I love you guys so much. I done spit on y'all. I'm sorry. Glory be to God. It's the spirit. Listen, I pray that you guys receive this word. If this is your word today, comment down below. Since this is my word today, it got to be. Glory be to God. And so we are on the road to 60,000 angels. To God be the glory, but I cannot do it without you guys. I need you guys to continue to do what you've been doing. Giving the videos a great big thumbs up. Make sure you like, you comment, you subscribe. Hit that bell to turn on your notifications so you never miss a video here at the Academy. Please share the videos out with at least three or four people that the Spirit leads you guys to. If you have not gotten your holy anointed oils yet, what is you doing, Pooh? Go down below and click on that link and go over and get your holy oils, family. I got my P.O. box open to everybody that want to send something out. Go look down below in the description. Matter of fact, I'll put it here on the video as well guys just so you guys have the information to everybody that want to sow a seed through the P.O. box send out a check whatever it is that you guys want to send me I do want you guys to send me out your testimonies and just just a personalized letter just something just to let me know you know what does the Angel Academy mean to you and how have I made a difference in your life I really appreciate you guys so much and so before you guys get out of here I need you guys to go over here and make sure you're subscribed to our other channels here on YouTube and that is the end of this video but always remember the secret to success say it with me y'all put god first always be determined and consistency is key period i love you guys and i will see you guys in my next video god willing i love you guys bye angels Mwah.